What's up, world class athlete guys? I'm so excited to be out here with one of my favorite students, Nala. Today, we're gonna to be mastering her ability to generate that effortless power from the ground and working specifically on her transfer move. So this video is gonna be broken down into three phases. And if you're someone right now who's struggling with being able to generate loads of power, you're struggling with high balls, or you just wanna to totally take command and dominate on your forehand, you're gonna love this because we're gonna master exactly how to use your feet, exactly how to accelerate and generate that massive racket flip, and then exactly how to follow through and use your body to generate that massive force every single time on your forehand transfer move. So I'm so fired up. Nala, let's jump right into the drills. Let's do this, let's go. All right, Nala, so in this first drill, I'm gonna go ahead and feed you some easy high put away shots. Let's see your absolute best, and then we'll take it from there. Ready, let's have some fun, here we go. Wow, such good feet, good recovery, way to land that split. Good setup, great technique. I love that contact, beautiful recovery. Look at that energy, amazing. Beautiful, wow, that's so strong. Feeling confident? Great feet, love that split. Nice, beautiful, beautiful. Here we go, two more. Yes, great legs, ready? Last one. Love that, let's go. All right, champ, that was amazing. Let's go ahead and break down your footage and see exactly what we wanna do. Take it to the next level. I know, so I'm feeling so excited. So what we'll do is let's go and pull out your footage of exactly what you were just executing. So I've identified that we're gonna master five key technical elements. The first is notice with your split step how you're splitting in a very uh, narrow fashion. In other words, that your knees are about in line with your hips. So the first thing that we're gonna master together is gonna be the wide split. So the reason why the wide split is so powerful and what you wanna look for is you wanna have your feet at least more than shoulder width apart. What this is gonna allow you to do is it's gonna allow you to adjust and move to the ball faster. Does that make sense? So that's gonna be number one, so you're gonna get in that wide split just like that. The second checkpoint is if we identify your footage, Notice how on a lot of the balls, you would actually get your chest rotated at the very last moment, which by rotating your chest late, do you think that's gonna create more or less tension? Exactly, and the key to crushing the shot is getting set to the ball early, staying very loose, and then being able to drive it with your whole body weight, very relaxed, going forward into the shot. So the second checkpoint, after we master that perfect split, you're gonna get focused on getting your body rotated faster. Now, technically, if we pull out your unit turn technique next to Nadal and Federer, you'll see that you're executing literally a world-class unit turn. So let's go, you're absolutely amazing. So all that work we've done has really paid off. Now, let's go ahead and break down the stance. So question, when you're dealing with high shots that you're trying to put away, what's the best stance that you wanna use? Exactly, what's that look like? Exactly, nice wide semi open, that's perfect. So notice on a lot of your shots though, you were executing a neutral stance, which is acceptable, but isn't gonna allow you to tap into, boom, that massive force going through your body. Which brings us now to the fourth technical checkpoint. Let's go ahead and break down your backswing. So on every single forehand, right, there's a five stage framework. You got the unit turn, and then what's this called? Exactly, backswing, and then you have the two part acceleration to the contact, and then you've got the Exactly. And by the way, if you guys want access to every single one of my five stage technical frameworks, you can click the link in the description to get access to my course, Transformation Week. It's the world's most comprehensive step by step course that you can follow to put all world class technical checkpoints in your unconscious muscle memory. So if we assess now Nala, you see that the primary difference between you and Federer was what did you see yourself doing with your backswing? You want to demonstrate? Exactly, so the key checkpoint is, rather than being at that position, what's the best position you can be in with the backswing? Perfect, exactly, because now once you're here, this is gonna allow you to generate that massive flip, right? So that's really, really key. The fifth and final checkpoint that we'll master is the key to crushing these transfers with a lot of power, is question, when you hit it, do you wanna be transferring your weight up and kinda back, or do you wanna be transferring your body weight forward and in with that right leg going back? Exactly, so to recap everything we're gonna master. Number one is we're gonna get your, you're gonna rotate a little bit earlier. You're gonna load in a, exactly. You're gonna get your backswing at 5.30 or six. You got it, and then with your body, you're gonna shift your weight forward or kind of go back and up? 
All right, let's go. All right, so now let's piece those together with the five of the best drills that we can use to accelerate your development. Let's go. All right, Nala, so in drill number one, what we're gonna focus on is we're gonna use a resistance band and you're gonna get set into that nice semi-open, wide, you should feel really comfortable and confident. And you're gonna feel the 530, you're gonna shift your weight forward, rotate, and then finish on your right leg just like this. This is gonna build that amazing intuition of transferring your weight forward. So it's gonna do about 15 to 20 reps, feeling amazing, getting that weight forward. Perfect, great right leg, I love that. Nice, pros bend a little bit more, that's right. Beautiful, great weight transfer. Great, feeling confident, feeling amazing. That's fantastic, I love that. Good right leg, beautiful. Now I'm gonna feed a ball, don't actually hit it, but try to time your leg drive. And leg drive, great, and feel that right leg go forward, so it goes super smooth. Beautiful, now here's the ball, and smooth. Beautiful, let's go two more, you're looking great. That's perfect, so good, last one. All right, absolutely perfect, you're ready. Here we go, drill number two, let's go. I know, so I'm so excited. Now we're gonna piece together your ability of doing that perfect split and then getting that early turn with that right leg finishing back. So really key, especially if we're uh, developing new habits, we wanna go really smooth, really slow, piecing it together step by step. So we're gonna go really, really easy, about 10 to 30% speed, just focusing on achieving technical perfection so you're absolutely perfect. Does that sound good? All right, let's do it, here we go. Wide split, adjust. Such good loading, such, look at that easy power, you're on fire. Let's go, Nala. Beautiful, look at that finish, that is absolutely gorgeous, amazing. Great technique, way to shift that weight forward. Let's go, wide split, beautiful, adjust. I love that. Now start a little bit further back, let's see how great your feet are. Wide split, beautiful, adjust. Great adjustment steps. On that last one, you still split about here, get even more aggressive with those legs and you're flawless. Yes, adjust, go. Great feet, I love that way to get there early, wide split, adjust. Great legs, I love how you're shifting that weight forward. Beautiful, here we go, two more. So good, great feet, I love that weight going forward. Ready, last one, great split, adjust. All right, absolutely amazing, Nala, huge improvements. If we play that back from a side angle, you'll see that your spacing is on point. From the back angle, your split was on point. And were you getting that right leg back? Let's go, beautiful job, such a fast learner. All right, let's jump in to drill number three. I know, so in this next drill, what we're gonna focus on implementing is with your backswing, which one's better? If I get my racket here or here? Exactly, so what we're gonna focus on to allow you to master this literally right away is rather than swinging really fast, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna feed you a ball and what you're gonna do is you're gonna split, adjust to the ball, and then you're just gonna freeze creating those key checkpoints. Does that make sense? And by doing that, that's gonna automatically give you that perfect technique. Okay, ready? So go ahead and get set back, time your perfect split, and let's see if you can achieve that perfect 530 checkpoint. That's flawless, good. Make sure you have that wide stance. I love that, great wide split, adjust. Let's go two more, wide split, adjust, and prep. That's world class, Nala, you look amazing. Last two, great split, beautiful adjustments. So good, make it feel natural, effortless, super confident, last one. All right, absolutely world-class, great job. Let's go to drill number four. In a shadow swing situation, you can literally dial that into perfection, which you've also got now your legs, your body, your contact. You're now ready to start generating that massive power. So what we're gonna do is rather than doing all this complexity, right, I'm gonna feed it so you don't even have to move. So this is an accelerated learning principle called isolation, which basically means rather than doing everything all at once, we're just gonna isolate and you're gonna start in this position. I'll feed you and you'll swing at about 50% speed, focusing on feeling that amazing flip and getting that right leg back. So let's go ahead and isolate this. And by the way, guys, if you want access to my four accelerated learning frameworks, which is gonna allow you to develop as fast as Nala is, as well as getting that world-class technique at the fastest rate, I would encourage you click the link in the description and check out Transformation Week. All right, Nala, here we go. Let's see, perfect semi-open. Beautiful, with your backswing, 530 tip, perfect. Then from there, accelerate and pull forward. Beautiful flip, that's amazing. Good, six o'clock, so you'll start there, that's right. And forward. Great, I love that technique, way to prep it. Good, keep that arm relaxed, and forward. Amazing, all right, you're looking great. Now let's integrate movement. Still super smooth, just focusing on, are you getting that perfect back? So here we go, great split. That's the one. All right, let's see 100% power, let's go. All out, great split, drive it, legs. Wow, that's so fire, beautiful legs, you're on fire. Good, there it is at six. Let's see one shadow, intense, let's see it. Beautiful, that's the one, feel it, right there. 
Good try, still six o'clock, feel 5.30, you're right here. Oh yeah, that was fire. All right champ, you ready to rally? Let's go. I know, so in this last drill, we're gonna rally together, but before we dive in, I just wanna role model the mindset of how you wanna be while attacking these shots. So the key checkpoint, whenever you're trying to put away a ball, what you guys wanna focus on is keeping the arm as relaxed as possible, focusing on achieving the key technical checkpoints that we covered, and generate the maximum amount of power from your leg and body, rotating and pulling into the shot, just like this. So aggressive feet, loose arm, happy legs, driving that weight in just like that. Wide split, setting up, uh, feeling super strong, confident, relaxed, uh, just like that. Good, last one, here we go. Wide split, setting up, uh, feeling great. All right, Nala, let's jump right in. All right, here we go, Nala, ready to piece it all together? Here we go, let's have some fun. Wide split, perfect technique, let's crush it. Great legs, uh, set up, kill. Beautiful hustle, here we go, you can come to the net when you're ready. Great legs, yes, great pop. That's it, and volley close. Oh, good try, good try. There, you wanna just cross step. Yeah. That's it. Good, way to get set. Good, contact early, kill this. Yes, let's go. That semi-open stance is amazing. Yes. Ah, uh, up. That's it. Kill it. Great. Oh, huge. That was in. Nice. Close. That's great. Ah. Oh, almost that ball was in your way. One more time. Perfectly timed split. Great. Yes. Ah. Oh, nice. Way to get it done. Here we go. We get that contact in front. All right, now I want to play with a little bit more pace. So focus on timing that split. If it comes deep, you can do your lateral hop, right? And then when it's short, put it away. So start, I'll give you an easy one. Great, wide split. <sighs> Beautiful legs. <sighs> Good, semi-open stance. Oh. Nice. Oh. Good legs, you got it, time your split. That's it. <sighs> Good, stay relaxed, split. That's it, great hands. Time your split again. Uh, beautiful, here we go, ready to put this away. Uh, oh, great try. Key, when you hit that ball, you were just coming down. The best volleyers step through contact. Here we go, ready? Step through. Yes! Ready? Yeah. That's it, aggressive. Semi. Yes! Same shot, adjust. Yeah, close. Oh, what the heck was that? You hit it such a good approach, but then you stopped a little bit. The key is when I hit that slice, it should look like this. You should have split and then prepped and then close down. Ready, try it again. You're gonna split and then come in for the volley close. Ready, pounce. That's it. All right, that was absolutely amazing. Unbelievable close. I love that, Nala. Great, great, great work. Boom. All right, world class athletes. So that concludes our lesson with Nala. That was so much fun. She improved so much. The key technical checkpoints that I love to keep focusing on in our next session is making sure that we're getting even better with that prep. But you've improved your footwork so much, the body so much, and it's so key. And for everybody that really wants to start improving at the fastest possible rate, notice the structure of our session. We broke down the key anatomical checkpoints to focus on, and then we built them through step by step to give her that amazing result in just one session. Again, I would highly encourage you, if you guys want access to the world's most comprehensive, accelerated learning principles that's going to allow you to develop at the fastest possible rate, click that link in the description so we can start a journey of unprecedented growth together. As always, I'm encouraging you guys, have that high level ambition, get out on the court, step by step, make those drills, make those changes, and you guys are going to become world class athletes. I'll see you guys in the next video. Let's go.